So I finally watched Interspecies Reviewers. By the way, Funimation dropped it like a prepubescent boy reading Playboy for the first time. I was expecting full frontal and maybe a girl shows her fucking chocolate starfish. I don't know, but that wasn't what it was. I mean, it was pretty tame. I mean, you've got stuff like Quasar of Stigmata, I think that's Stigmata of Quasar. I think that's the name of it. That one's pretty out there and... Fuck, even the table-humping scene from Code Geass was... Comparatively, the two were very similar. I don't understand why after four episodes, Funimation just stopped doing it. Fuck, even when Critical Mass, the porn licensing branch of Right Stuff Anime, when they picked it up, it's still censored. They fucking censor the middle finger, for Christ's sake. Any, like, dildo that's in the shot is mosaic censored. So it's it's a porn label in the U.S., but they still used the, like, raw file from Japan. And Japan can't show any genitalia, I guess, fake or real. So it has to be mosaic censored. I honestly don't know why it had such a big controversy going around it. It is a good show. There's, there's, you know, all I need in life are big tittied anime girls. And I'm fine. So I, I thoroughly enjoyed it. I just don't understand why Funimation were pussies about it and didn't want to touch it with a 10 foot big hot meaty rod. I don't know, but I finally got to see it. Uh, I had to wait for, like I said, Critical Mass's release of it. They released the Steelbook edition of it. You know, I didn't mind waiting. I would have preferred to see it uncensored anyways. So I was going to buy it whether or not Funimation did the whole thing or not. So that's pretty much it. I mean... I finally got to see it. It it was it, it was a good watch, very enjoyable. Loved seeing all of the different species. And uh yeah, I think the only reason Funimation didn't continue streaming it is because of the subject matter. Yeah, it had nudity and sex, but America is such a prude that fucking just because it's sex that someone paid for you know, we can't do that. That That's just, that's, that's just insane. You know? Th those aren't real jobs. The, how fucking... What is this, Sodom and Gomorrah? So, I, I think that that's just... You know, their fucking investors didn't want to invest in a company that would license a show that gave credence to actual sex work. Uh, that That is the only reason... And even when Right Stuff picked it up, they still had to do it on their porn label because, again, no one wants to invest in a company that fucking supports sex work, I guess. Anyway, it's a decent show. You should check it out. Um, like I said, Right Stuff Anime sells it. I think it I think it was like $69 for the Steelbook Edition, and it comes with a, a an art book and the soundtrack. So, pretty cool. Bye-bye.